Blood pressure and heart disease are closely interrelated. Hypertension, which is high blood pressure, can cause heart disease or worsen pre-existing heart disease. On the other hand, animals with severe primary heart disease often have hypotension or low blood pressure. Blood pressure in animals is measured similarly to how we check blood pressure in humans, although the cuffs are much smaller. After the cuff is secured to the front leg, it is inflated to make sure it won't detach or loosen. The cuff is then deflated again. Alcohol is then used to wet the animal's fur on the underside of the paw, and a special ultrasonic gel is applied to the paw as well. A special Doppler crystal is placed underneath the paw and used to find the animal's pulse. Once a clear pulse can be heard, a sphygmomanometer is used to inflate the cuff, causing the pressure inside the cuff to rise to 200. This high pressure cuts off blood flow to the paw and the pulse can no longer be heard. The cuff is then slowly deflated until the pulse can be heard again. The reading at which the pulse can first be heard again is the systolic blood pressure measurement. A normal reading would be 120, although values of up to 160 are considered acceptable in the veterinary hospital. For more information about our cardiology department, visit aercmn.com or petcardiologistmn.com.